Hey guys, how you doing today? I haven't done a video in a while, so I figured uh, I'd give you some updates as to what's going on in the silver community. And the latest buzz was on the Hades coin. Uh, not as much as uh, what we expect, uh, what we had uh, with the Poseidon coin, but we did expect some buzz for this coin, but uh, not that much. People did not ask me about the coin. I didn't do a video on it because, I don't know, maybe the... Uh, the big hype kind of fizzed out for this series because this is the last one and it's over. So uh, here is a picture of the actual coin that one person has already uh, got in their hands and uh, sent me a picture of it. And uh, looks like, uh, um, you know, a little bit more subtle compared to the first two in that it's not uh, super detailed like the first two. Whereas this one, um, Hades is taking up a bigger portion of the coin and looks more simple, but yet has, you can see the throne, you see the dogs, and you see the fire in the back. So uh, uh, they used a more of a simplified approach, but uh, I think when you see it in real life in your own hands, uh, from what I heard, uh, there is more of a 3D effect to this uh, coin. Here's another picture of the coin, actually, and still in the uh, the black uh, velvet case here. Um, you you see the same kind of uh, look and feel to it. Uh, you know, I, when I uh, tried to buy this, uh, obviously, I, I'm sure everybody went through the same thing where the website was crashing or giving you an error, and the coin, which was supposed to be up at eight o'clock. Uh, Eastern Standard Time, 5 p.m. Western Standard Time. Um, I don't think uh, people were able to see the actual coin listed until like 30 minutes later. Okay, so I was on there hitting, you know, re refresh or click on the God of Zeus page again and again and again, and I kept getting the same thing over and over, right? So I'm like, wait a second, they're not even listing the coin here. Something is wrong. So I called them to find out what's going on with, you know, whether they're going to uh, put the coin up for sale or not. Maybe I, maybe they delayed it. You know, I don't know. So I called these guys and, um, you know, I wanted to reach uh, one of the contacts there. Uh, but for some reason, I got the automated system where it started asking me stuff like, well, would you like to purchase a coin? Please press one or something like that, right? So I press one and waiting for the uh, customer service rep to answer my call. And after maybe like 10 to 15 minutes, he answered. And before even asking about the website problem, I asked him if I could buy the coin. And he said, sure, you can buy the coin right over the phone. I said, great. So I was able to get one. And uh, I just got the confirmation uh, email last night. So... Uh, uh, I was one of the fortunate ones to get this coin. I was wondering how others out there in the YouTube community fared with this coin. If you were able to get it, if you were not able to get it, uh, if you can chime down below, that would be great. And just a general consensus, I, I would like to know what you guys think of this design compared to the first two. Um, at the moment, my, my uh, opinion is that the Zeus is still the best looking coin. Poseidon is the second and this one is the third but until I see all of them uh, with my own eyes uh, you know that might that could actually change and on to other news uh, let's take a look at the spot here uh, people have been saying that you know since we broke down below 17 uh, we went down to as like low as like 16 60 something um, but uh, we have rebounded back over to 1739 ish and gold has uh, uh bump, bump back up beyond twelve twelve hundred dollars so uh, uh metal prices have recovered a little bit um and then like uh atmex got this uh the legend lives some kind of thing coming on with uh, i think this is rcm you got some wolf coins or some kind of special wolf timber wolf coming out so that's one of the things to look out for i don't know exactly what it is but they do have a video, just, uh, it's like a teaser video. They don't show you any of the coins or anything like that. But that's what's coming out from them. And JM Bullion still has their Horsbury uh, Britannia coin 
for a buck 69 over spot i thought they were going to end the sale uh, a couple nights ago or what was it last night i don't really exactly remember but you can still get it for 194.20 if you buy at least one set which is 10 coins uh, it has gone down to as low as like 186 uh, so it's a little bit over eight dollars over the, its low so far and uh, other than that uh, the deals have been very quiet some people have uh, received their coins back from uh, wholesalecoinsdirect.com and uh, we're very pleased with some of the uh, goat, uh, lunar goat, goat orders because uh, um, these are going for like 29 from most dealers except for here um, they were able to offer it for a, re a, re a very low price 22.18 with the e-check so it's like 23 bucks with a credit card but uh, they had other coins uh, over here from the Perth that was a pretty good deal but I think uh, they raised the prices on those like uh, this two ounce goat was like 40 bucks or you know uh, this is still a not bad deal, not a bad deal but uh, yeah like the five ounce goat was under a hundred dollars it was like I don't remember it was like maybe 80 to 90 bucks and the 10 ounce coin was cheaper I mean it's still a decent price but uh, they had some really good deals on it but I think they raised the price a little bit and uh, so far from the people who bought it got their coins and they are very pleased with it so I just wanted to report back on that so uh, that's about it for today uh, I'm trying to uh, put up more videos in the near future uh, if I find anything to report on so thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you guys on the next video